the bus too hard. The bottom right one. You're really rocking the whole bus. Super hard. Well, we already ordered a new wheel seal to the side just to automatically be able to replace that seal. We can see it's leaking now. Shocks on too, so they new airbags, new shocks. Another one, new airbags, new shock. Good news is that wheel seal leak hadn't got to the brakes, so they just need to be cleaned up a little bit, but there's no oil or grease all over them. That's good. We're gonna pull that all off. All right, I got this other front airbag off of here. One of these bolts you could not get to at all. We had to sacrifice the wrench and make it big work. It, we couldn't even get a single ratchet on the wrench. Now socket wouldn't fit, even quarter inch drive, nothing with a swivel. We tried multiple different options, curved wrenches, nothing would get in there and get it. We even had a flex head ratcheting, wouldn't do it. This regular ratcheting one made it skinnier and then screwed, the, shaved that side off. And then you had just enough to get one click on it and still long enough to get torque. We had a mini shorty little uh, ratcheting wrench, but you couldn't get any torque to get to it. Your fingertips, you can only reach it with your fingertips. It just was impossible. So sacrifice your wrench, but it got it off. That's been on there. He's been fighting that for days. Tyler had to take this airbag off that they put on. If you look at it, you see how skinny it is right there? They didn't have it properly seated on either side on the ring. On the other side, they actually damaged putting it on. That's a brand new airbag and that is screwed. Um, I don't know if they were trying to bang on it with a screwdriver in there or something, but you can see it's not seated in the ring correctly. That's crazy. So we got to replace it. This airbag needs to be replaced. We're putting it on now just so we can air the bus up and move it. But uh, that did not get done right. Okay, so we're taking off the passenger side rear hub on here. Tyler's going to hold my camera for me. And there is a clunk in the bearing. I don't know if you can see it jump. From there to there, there's, not, it, there's no tension at all. It's just clunk, 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 clunk. I don't know what we're going to find in there. It will be exciting. I never had to fight one of these so hard. If you guys are wondering, the other phone set up right here. Live stream on Patreon. They're getting to watch all this in real time.
Well, that's you know, I love it when the grease is cracked. That's some ancient grease in there. <laughs> like, uh, Julius Caesar put it on there? Is that ancient Greece? <laughs> was he Greek? Oh, he's Roman. Who's Greek? <laughs> I have ancient Greek on my arm. <laughs> I don't think that's been done since Greyhound had it. <laughs> Zeus. There's an ancient Greek. <laughs> I think some oil's been getting in there too. Yeah, just a little bit. Not too bad though. What I really want to know is, is that nut tight or loose? I'll just clean my hands later. You, the socket is right next to you. That's right. Oh, it's that's at least a good sign. But now I went and got dirty. <laughs> that's a good sign. That's not necessarily a good sign that could be over tightened. No, because it's the inner. We'll be good. You can pause it for now. I gotta go get some. Okay. There's one race. Big old groove top and bottom where you in the middle is all chunked out, worn away. <laughs> Obviously the bearings look like crap. The other race is just as bad. I don't know if you can see it down there or not. Just have to trust us. <laughs> so I was redoing this airbag real quick. That was that's the one that was messed up, and uh, he's got everything now poking down through the holes, getting ready to. You got one. You got one more nut or two? Two. <sighs> two more nuts. They're all right next to each other, so they'll be in good shape. And this other one is done on the other side. Well, I think so. There's our Airstream, motorhome. Tyler's gonna be doing some work on this. He's got a cat. He's a, he's a cat. Um, so he's gonna be doing some work on that. Let's find that. So that's our buddy Sal's Airstream. Sal's there brought us the burn barrels and stuff here that we got for the property and our oil storage barrels and stuff. Oh, it's windy out. Tyler's going to lead him up the hill, show him how to make the turns up there. We had an incident on the live stream where the bus shifted. See those wood blocks there? They're leaning this way. They're tipped into the side. Um, that had the axle on it right as we were putting these wheels on. We jacked it up just enough to do that and then it was shifting over. Luckily we were able to catch it with the rim because the rim was already on the part of the hub. Uh, and then we came and got a floor jack and put a floor jack under the outside of the hub to get the inner wheel on. But uh, those, those blocks are definitely leaning under there. Um, they couldn't have went far because we had safety blocks and a jack on the other side, but we still didn't want it to shift. And it was low enough where we couldn't get the tire on so it was it was actually a little difficult at the time and I didn't want to stick my head under there to raise that jack more because it was uh, leaning so much but 
we had plenty of safety blocks. Again, it couldn't have gone anywhere far, but it was still, it was, it was not a fun situation. Okay, it's starting to rain pretty good, but we got the wheels back on in the scenic cruiser. We had a lot of work that we got done today. Um, this side's basically done. I have two little nuts down here that need to get tightened up still. Um, but all that's done, wheels are on, drive wheels are on. We had that incident where it was trying to fall off of the blocks. That was crazy. This side's got all new wheel seals, all that kind of stuff. The only hub that we have not inspected as of yet is the tag on this side. We put the drive hub back on with the bad bearings. Uh, we ordered the bearings today from Luke and Races. Uh, they'll be here Monday, but I need to make it movable here on the property. And then we only have these two airbags left to do back here too. And then we're gonna change that one. Needs a new plate because the, the long bolts got broken when they were taking them off. And then that front airbag needs to be replaced again because they damaged it when they were putting it on. It wasn't seated correctly and it was torn through. So, but hopefully we'll have, we'll be able to air it up tomorrow. I don't think it's gonna leak too bad up there. We got the brake system fixed, all that kind of stuff. The new kingpin, everything's in. So again, they'll have time to come here and finish it next week. I just need to get this off the pad for this weekend. They can work on it on the gravel pad and I'll work on it. Uh, Lance's bus here on the concrete tomorrow or Saturday. So we just got to let it down off the jacks. I have like six, I think I have six, maybe seven jacks under it right now. Um, so we'll start that process tomorrow, but it's just raining and we don't want to lay on the ground right now, but we were just minutes away from finishing up the job. Just going to put these wheels on and then we were done. So anyways, uh, we'll get to this tomorrow and uh, finish it up and hopefully get it moved around. Get that bus grease monkey on the road Well, he's got that hammer down and that 47 hound It's that bus grease monkey on the road He travels all around and he's coming to your town Get that bus grease monkey down the road that bus grease monkey do his thing 30 years behind that barn cause it don't run worth a darn watch that bus grease monkey make it sing he knows in detroit there's no doubt upside down and inside out it's that bus grease monkey don't you know saving buses far and wide in that old blue silver sides it's that bus grease monkey don't you know now he's moved his family to the hills of Tennessee Watch that bus grease monkey make his home Bringing buses back to life with the help of his dear wife Watch that bus grease monkey get it done Well he travels town to town looking on them old greyhounds It's that bus grease monkey don't you know Buses far and wide in old Lenny the Silver Sides. It's that bus grease monkey, don't you know? 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 